Prince Harry appeared to avoid Donald Trump during a tour at Buckingham Palace yesterday, but, according to a newly resurfaced interview, the Duke of Sussex might not entirely dislike the US president. Donald Trump and his wife, Melania, are currently in the UK for an three-day visit. Yesterday morning, the US president and his wife received the welcome ceremony at Buckingham Palace, greeted by the Queen, Prince Charles and the Duchess of Cornwall. After a private lunch at the monarch's headquarters, Mr. Trump and Mrs. Trump received a guided tour of the royal collection, which was also attended by the Duke of Sussex. During the visit, Prince Harry seemed to keep himself as far away as possible from the American firebrand. Royal correspondent Ingrid Seward accused him of appearing to behave in a rather immature way and letting his personal animosity take over from his natural good manners. Prince Harry's wife, Meghan Markle, who was reportedly at home with their newborn baby Archie, backed Mr. Trump's Democrat rival Hillary Clinton during the 2016 election, and said she would move to Canada if he won. In an exclusive interview with The Sun before his UK visit, the US president learned of the Duchess's comments and said he didn't know she was nasty, a jibe that reportedly angered Harry. However, according to a newly resurfaced interview, the Duke of Sussex did not seem as opposed to Mr. Trump's presidency as he seems now. Meghan's estranged father Thomas told ITV's Good Morning Britain in 2018, ahead of Mr. Trump's first working visit to the UK last year, that Prince Harry called for the US president to be given a chance. Mr. Markle revealed he was angry about something the business tycoon had done when he spoke on the phone with Harry for the first time in 2016. He said, I have always had a bad attitude about Donald Trump and that is never going to change. My God, I've got to apologize to the rest of the world for my president. All Harry actually did was say because Trump was new, we should give him a chance. Meghan's father added he was hoping his son-in-law had changed his attitude towards President Trump. Last year, Thomas also criticized the Queen for agreeing to meet the arrogant and insensitive politician before him. Speaking to TMZ, he said, if the Queen is willing to meet our arrogant and insensitive president she has no excuse not to meet me, I'm nowhere near as bad. Meghan and her father have reportedly not spoken since her royal wedding to Prince Harry last year. Just days before the nuptials, it was revealed Thomas had been hit with a heart problem and was too ill to make the trip. The announcement came as he admitted he was paid to stage paparazzi photos to sell to news outlets in an effort to improve his image.